examination card 12. Read the text and answer the questions. In the 19th century, in the United States, it was not unusual for extended families for uncles, aunts, cousins, aunts, cousins, and grandparents to live together in the same home. Then, in this century, nuclear families became popular. Only the parents and their children lived together. Recently, in the United States, many parents and children have began, begun living with grandparents again. Often, parents and children don't have uh, don't uh, don't want to spend their parents and grandparents to a special nursing home for all older people. Uh, they think it's better to take care of the elderly person uh, at home. Of course, there can be problems with uh, when people of three generations live in the same house. Grandparents are often more permissive, temperate, and they uh, they let children do they let children do what they want. But most people, most American parents, feel that it's better to be uh, strict. Uh, they feel that children should follow rules. Parents think that grandparents who don't make children obey will spoil them. Then the children won't obey uh, anyone as they are growing up. But having grandparents at home can also be fun. For example, everyone enjoys the stories that the older people tell and, the, uh, and uh, the interesting things that they can teach the other family members. Americans are learning that uh, having elder people at home can be a wonderful experience. How did people used to live in the USA in the 19th century? In the 19th century, in the United States, it was not unusual for extended families, for uh, families of uncles, aunts, cousins, and grandparents to live together in the same home. Can there be problems when people of three generations live in the same house? Of course, there can be problems when people of three generations live in the same house. The word learning is synonymous to study. According to the text, grandparents spoil their uh, children. Having grandparents at home can also be fun. Write the verbs in the right uh, tense form. We found a tour around the park fascinating because we saw animals we had only read about in books before, such as zebras and elephants. We were delighted to see them in real life. Anyway, just after we entered the part where, uh, part where the monkeys lived, the bus had a puncture. While the wheel uh, was uh, being uh, being trained, the whole group of monkeys approached the bus and started climbing over it. We had never felt so thrilled in our lives, and we showed it with joy and excitement. Translate the sentences from Armenian into English. Now you will write another exercise. This is uh, very difficult. He drew that picture two months ago. He can take part in that discussion. You were invited to the concert last week, weren't you? Why doesn't he want to take part in the uh, next question? He didn't say me anything about it. Something had happened to him, but he tried to hide everything. Everything. Write questions uh, or answer to the given dialogue. Dialogue 12. Good afternoon, Kate. How are you? Good afternoon. I'm great. How about you? Very busy. I don't have time. What do you have to do? Well, I have to do uh, the shopping. What are you doing today? Uh, I don't have much to do. Can we meet today? Sure, we can meet at 7 in the evening. I'll finish everything by that time. When will we? Uh, will you be free? Okay, I will, you, I will be free at 7. 